Hey guys and dolls, how are we this week? I'm here to do your career reading. You can call me Stella, and this career reading's for Aries. I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. And my information's below if you'd like to work with me, and please follow me on Instagram. So for the sign of Aries, your sun, moon, rising, Mars, or Midhaven. So you're kind of lacking passion in some sort of endeavor. And maybe it's because... Um, I feel like some misinformation has been spread around. We have the Ace of Swords in reverse and then the Seven of Swords here. And the Knight of Wands. So it's like your workplace is, or some sort of work environment has been affected by lack of information or misinformation. So maybe they're unaware of something, and that's kind of affected um, your work relationship. Ten of Swords in the reverse. Lot of Swords, a lot of mental energy here. Five of Swords and the Lovers. So I feel like... There's people that care about you or maybe some sort of potential or there was some sort of work relationship that was affected by kind of this missing information or misinformation. And then I have Ace of Cups coming out on the Ten of Swords reverse. So I feel like... Once the correct information can be presented, um, that this energy, that all this sword energy can kind of clear itself. The tower, the chariot, the magician, the hanged man. And if you look at my Sagittarius right, uh, reading for this week, this is the third time I've pulled the magician with the hangman together. And I've shuffled this deck numerous times. Um, so this might happen in March when we have that um, Aries Pisces transition mid March. The chariot, the tower. So something has to like something has to clear itself out for everything to be righted. Is kind of the sense I'm having. But we have these two people here that are being attacked by these swords. And then we have the lovers here behind the two of cups. Death card, sun, four of cups, four of wands. So I feel like there is a potential for some sort of like work love relationship that kind of got um what's the word I'm looking for these people think very highly of you they respect you um they didn't want to let you go but then something kind of happened this shake up this tower moment and then um, maybe all of a sudden you were gone or um, you had to quit suddenly and there's a lot of confusion as to what happened but um, they definitely still think very highly of you there's just a lot of confusion as to uh, what happened but with the chariot magician hanged man here it's kind of like yes we want you back like um, can you kind of clear the air, but you're left maybe after not sure if you want to go back to that job. I'm going to see if there's more opportunities. Let's see what other opportunities are there for. Let's 
So the world was in the back of deck and it's still there. So somebody's going through a major transition and then we have the chariot and the seven of pentacles. So this guy's kind of bummed out. He's kind of sitting and waiting for his pentacles to kind of grow, but then he's also leaving and he's got a cup behind him. So you could be taking people with you and going to another job. Um, money could be, money doesn't grow on trees, so <laughs> money could be a little bit tight right now, but these things are going to come in. It feels like you're moving on to something else or something more lucrative. So you could be in talks for more money. Justice, the moon, justice against the illusion. So whatever happened, I think definitely clear the air. I wanna see this ace of swords in the upright position. Um, and I think it'll do a lot. It'll do a lot for um, like maybe somebody had some like was ill or needed to take time away for family reasons, that kind of stuff. So um, yeah, just be clear and speak your truth. That's my advice. Okay. So again, my information is below if you'd like to work with me, have any questions. And uh, yeah, follow me on Instagram. See you guys.